Hello and welcome to our new central listing, the FAR 100 Leopard. We're here at the Palmer Super Yacht Show where she is on display. Leopard is a 100 foot canting keel charter and race yacht. Walking up the starboard side here, we've just walked past the starboard dagger board onto the vast foredeck and up to the bow. She has an asymmetric spinnaker setup with a fixed bowsprit. Walking back down the bow, we walk past the forepeak underneath the owner's cabin, past the controls for the jib and back to the mast. Although fitted out very much so for racing, she is an amazing charter yacht. Walking back down the port side, you can see how clean and uncluttered the decks are. The yacht is currently fitted out for charter purpose with the cushions and the tables and the cockpit. She has plenty of room for all the crew and guests. That is the companion way down to the crew quarters and the nav station. All the canting keel mechanism is controlled at either helm station. For a clear view forward and to all the instrumentation as well. The four main pit winches are located behind the cockpit. And you can see behind there the primary winches and the main sheet pedestal in the middle. The communications mast is at the back well out of the way of all the sail controls. Heading below to the main saloon. The main saloon area is vast, very handy for racing and also gives a huge amount of socialising space when under charter. The hull is constructed of carbon fibre and Nomex sandwich. The interior furniture is also made out of the same and spray painted. The yacht has one owner's cabin two doubles and two small single berthed crew cabins forward. In the aft end of the yacht there is all the crew accommodation 
in the form of pipe cots plus the galley and a crew mess area. Heading forwards past the feature mast, easy access to the mast shims. Heading forward further up to the owner's cabin in the bow area. The owner's cabin is a centerline double with separated shower and heads. The heads is on the port side with plenty of room. The shower is on the starboard side with a custom carbon back panel and high quality fittings throughout the boat. Further aft, we have two mirror image cabins. This is the starboard double with ensuite. And on the other side, the port double with the ensuite. Heading further back, we have the two small bunk cabins. This is the starboard with steps up. These are ideal for children or crew on passage. And into the port, there's plenty of storage space in these two cabins, both under the bunk and to the left there. Now we're going aft in the yacht here, towards the crew mess area. A seating area with pipe cot, they're lifted up there. There's a full heads unit with shower. and back towards the large table area which underneath has the hydraulic monofloid and all the electronics circuitry. The crew area has six berths, two pipe cots on each side. This is the aft section of pipe cots which is a mirror imaged on the starboard side, that's the port one. The galley for the yacht is fitted out for corporate hospitality and has a huge surface area, refrigeration volume and cooking facilities. Moving aft on the starboard side of the yacht, you see the other pipe cots there. The hub of the yacht here is the nav station with every instrument you can think of, including a touch screen overall control for the yacht which is repeated on both the port and the starboard side. Two computer screens, one for the boat and one purely for the navigation. A standalone GPS and a backup. 
They've had all the communications you could dream of for offshore racing and ocean sailing. Back to the crew quarters table, and as I said earlier, underneath here we have the hydraulic manifold. We also have all the electric systems, well sealed, but easily accessible. When the boat was designed, this was a big feature of the yacht to enable the captain to get to the electronics. So there we have Leopard, the FAR 100.